The things we design, more often than not, are much larger than what can fit within the boundaries of a screen. So being able to draw in scale becomes critical. Start by opening the precision panel from the status bar up here and activate measure. This is optional, but a great way to visualize scale. The dimensions of things are always recorded in concepts though, so you can activate it later if you so choose. Next to the word measure, you can see the current scale, which defaults to one to one. This means that when I draw a 10 centimeter line on screen, it will be displayed as 10 centimeters. And this is true to life, as long as the zoom level is set to 100%. To set a different scale, tap on the value in the precision menu, and the app will open the workspace settings, where you can directly type in the new scale. Let's just type in two, so we end up with a one to two scale. Now you can see what used to be 10 centimeters is now 20 centimeters because we're working at a one to two scale. Commonly used scales are listed below the values here, so you don't even have to type in anything, just choose the one you need and start drafting. This is also where you control the units and format of your measurements, by the way, and you can access these settings from the settings icon up here. Everything in the app that uses measurements will adapt to these changes from the grid in the background to the size presets of your brushes. Now let me demonstrate how to set scale with an imported plan or photo. I'll just set the scale back to one to one for clarity's sake. First, you'll need to have one accurate measurement of the plan. Make sure measurement is active and select the line tool from the guides menu. Place the guide on the area with a known measurement. It helps to double tap the crosshair at the center to contain the boundaries of the line to your measurement while drawing. Now just tap on the scale value up here or optionally down here. On the left, you'll see the on-screen measurement and on the right, we'll type in the known value. So 4.6 centimeters on screen equals 2300 millimeters in the actual space. And there you have it. This drawing is set at the scale of one to 50 which is shown in the precision panel over here. Now when we draw on the image, the measurements are displayed at the right scale. 